you have to check this out. You can create a website just like this one in a few minutes with simple clicks with the help of AI. It's super simple and I'm gonna show you how to do it in simple steps. So let's jump into the computer right now. And as you can see here, head on to one.com. So this is the main page. It might look different depending on when you're seeing this video, but let's keep going because it's the same steps you will take regardless if the page looks slightly different or you're looking into a different language. If you're in the home page, just come here in the menu on the top, you will see website and then head to website builder. So this is the website builder created by one.com. And if you scroll the page down a little bit, so build your dream website in record time. This is exactly what we're talking about here. And this will use AI to help you to build your website in just no time. So let's go for it and let's see. So if you look here, you have, hello, I'm here to help get started. What type of website do you need, right? So then pick a topic and, or you can write your own top. So let's close this and let's pick something. So let's say a restaurant website and then let's see. All right, could you share the name and what you have in mind? So let's call it uh, fish and chips witness days. All right, so let's call it this and then let's see what it says. All right, thank you. Could you also provide a short description of your fish and chips Wednesdays restaurant? Of course. So let's say this is the best fish and chips restaurant in entire Copenhagen area. Let's check it out now what it will do for us. So thank you for providing the details. I'm now generating your website. So you saw just answering a few questions about your business it's already coming up <laughs> and look at that it's already here so you already have a template to work with and let's see how it looks so you can book a table you have all these in the menu uh, taste of denmark fish and chips wednesday delight so <laughs> you see that it already has some very relevant keywords uh, regarding what i pushed uh, in that chat so it's very interesting to see then you have some special offers and everything that you can see here looks good already to be honest but i would recommend of course you swap the photos for your actual business photos and all the text that you can see here you can just tweak and change things around you can customize everything this is just a great head start for you because you don't have to start from a blank canvas. You already have something that is a bit more tailored to what you need. And then you can just go there and change things uh, super easily. So let's see, let's say you like this template and you want to continue designing. So let's hit here and this will bring you to the website builder. And here you have the option to sign up for a 14 day free trial to test out the tool. And there you can tweak the template just like I told you, you can do it. So you can do that for free. No credit card is required. So you just enter your email. So I'm entering a test email right here and then you enter a password, right? And then of course, if you want to receive tips, I also recommend you to tag this box right here. We always send relevant information. We're not going to spam you. So go ahead and do that if you want your business to succeed because there are great tips that we send out for you. We have a team dedicated to creating good content for you that. And then you have to agree with the terms and conditions uh, to sign up for the trial. All right, so let's start the free trial right here. All right, so here inside the website builder trial and you can see that you, you have available for you the custom website AI generated for you. And then here you can change the color and these colors, they are here to help you to keep a consistent branding throughout your entire website. So you can choose one of the pre-selected colors. There are lots of to choose from, but you can also come to custom and add it one by one manually if you have custom codes for your brand already, sorry, custom colors for your brand already. 
then you can just come here and change those and make it right. Let's say we're good. Uh, no, I don't like this red actually. So let's go back and let's choose. Uh, I would rather have this first one. So let's go with that one and then hit apply. All right. So as you can see, we're in the trial. You can ask it to show you around. I'm gonna do a quick walk around with you here so you don't have to do that if you don't want that. But if you click here, it will just show you the functionality that you find inside the website builder, right? So let's just skip the tour. And also, of course, you are on the 14 day free trial. You didn't enter any credit card or anything. So if you don't want uh, to use the product after, you just leave it the 14 days will go by and you will lose access to the tool, right? Otherwise, you can sign up and uh, you can choose the best plan for your needs and get your website live in a matter of hours or even minutes, if depending how fast you are to tweak the website to the way you want it, right? All right, so launch your shop on your website. So you also have that option. So we have a shop built in and we, l let me show you around first, right? So just so you see how easy it is to edit stuff. So let's say Taste of Denmark, Fish and Chips Wednesday Delight. As you can see here, you have the writing assistant and that's also based uh, with AI to help you to write. So if you click here and you come to writing assistant, you can ask to write a new text or you can ask to modify it. Let's just ask to modify and of course you have to agree to uh, the terms and conditions and so on uh, but then you have the options here to rewrite make shorter make longer or you can also type in any information uh, of what you're looking for and then it will tweak to you but let's say in this case we just want to make it shorter so i click here and then it will give you an option, delightful Danish fish and chips. That's better. So let's say use this text right here and then it's already updated here on the website, right? Well, let's say, oh, it doesn't look the best. I want it to be in just one line. You can either expand like this and now it is all in one line and voila. It's as easy as that. You can change stuff around, you can move things and that's as easy as that. If you didn't want the writing assistant, for example, you can just double click and you can add text in here and that will be as easy as that, right? And you can also have this uh, formatting option. So let's say you don't want things to be centralized. You can change the configuration of how things look and so on and so forth. So it's super easy to customize. And again, it's everything drag and drop. So if you click here and you want the button here, you can have the button there. Of course, it doesn't look good in this scenario, but you get what I mean, right? Uh, the thing is, it's super easy to tweak things. So this is a button, for example. If there was no button here, of course, course you have all these things on the left side menu here and there is the button and if you click here it will add a button to you you can make it longer you can make it uh, bigger so it depends on how you want the button to be and of course you can edit the button and there's way more stuff you can customize so the example here you have the the CTA or the text of the button so you could say maybe um, see more or i don't know anything you want your restaurant to display or let's see here see menu so i think that's a bit more of a cta and then what you can do is by edit you can make it uh, with a lot of uh, different customization so you have different kinds of buttons uh, so you have the primary secondary and alternate and you can edit the styles of your buttons and they will always match with the colors of the theme that you picked in the beginning so that's really nice so you keep everything consistent throughout your entire website right and then what you can do here is you can change font but you can also add a link so let's say you want to throw people who click on this to a menu so you can add a link here to the menu and then people can see the menu you can also change the style of the button as i showed you as primary secondary but if you click on this engine right here you have way more options to tweak right so you can change font size bold italic you can change the corner so let's say you want more of a rounded corner so you can do that i think that is too much 
this should be good and then when you hit done so there you have it so when you click edit you have all these options to play with and also if you click show more actions you have some more things to do here uh, but it says the same as right clicking an element on your screen right so what else can we do so like changing photos for example you can click here and replace image and you have some that you can just throw in from your driver so if you have your own business and you have your photos i re really recommend you to upload your photos original photos in here but let's say you just need something to illustrate your point you have a lot of images here that are free from one.com those images are sourced from unsplash.com so they are free for you to use you don't have any copyright issues because you have the rights to use those photos right um, so you can come here and look for something so let's say you want to show a restaurant if you type in it will show you a lot of variety of images and good looking images so let's say you want something like this you can just click and add to page and there you have it so now the image is changed if you double click you can also drag so it shows only part of the image that you like and when you click off now it's only the selection portion uh, showing up here so it's as easy as that again everything drag and drop so if you want that on this side and this on this side you can definitely do that it's super easy or you can undo if you prefer uh, the other way around which i do and that's how it goes for everything in this tutorial so it's super easy to tweak and you can find a lot of things you can add to the website right here so text for example if you want a text you click there you have it you have a new text right and then same as an image you can add an image just like we did from the background but you can uh, just select them here as well you'll have a gallery so you can add galleries to the website you can add um, a bunch of photos let's say if you want to show um, a menu uh, in photo styles you can do that on your home page here for example you also have the option of introducing videos to your website which is fantastic sometimes depending on the product you have or the services you offer it's nice having an image or actually a video to show your customers exactly what you do how you work and the quality of the stuff that you produce so a video is really good to do that and you can have that on your website and people will see and it will definitely make a difference then you have the buttons like i told you you have also sections so let's say you want to add a new section in between these two if you click add a session it goes right in here and let's say you can choose a bunch of pre-made uh, templates here uh, for a new section or you can also add just a blank section and then add all their elements on top of it so let's do that so you add a blank one and then let's say you want a container and then you can come here and drag stuff around and you have new things on the page of course this doesn't look good because i'm just doing it on the run but if you take your time they will look good but if you want to start already for something that looks a bit better just go to the built-in uh, section here and then you can choose something that might be a bit better already and then you can just maybe change the photos and, and so on and so forth so here we have an extra uh, section let's say we want to reduce uh, remove that you, you can flip them order so you can put them up and down but you can also just delete the section if you don't need it uh, so you don't have extra space in between right in this case i'm not going to keep this but you see how easy it is to do things all right so what else do we have so we have contact forms you can put a phone email address opening hours and you also have pre-built uh, uh, blocks in here that you can use for contacts in the contact section all right here you also have social so you can put social galleries if you have instagram if you have google reviews for your businesses there is a plugin right here you can just throw it into the website builder and it will be already connected to the google reviews you have and then you also have some other widgets about social you have images videos like i showed you but then businesses like paypal mailchimp 
So there are a lot of things for you to explore here. Also Google Maps, if you wanna have maps, I think this one already has one here underneath. So this is how it would look like with maps. So it's very nice if you have a physical store or something that people can find and go to you, right? So I do recommend you to have those if you have a physical store. Uh, so after widgets, we also have the online shop. So if you want to sell things online, uh, any plan from one.com, you can have a minimum of three products uh, to test it out. And if you go to our business and e-commerce tier, uh, then you can have unlimited products because that's the plan that is tailored for e-commerce businesses. But at any plan, you can test up to three products and sell them on your website without any extra fee or anything. Uh, all right, so that's pretty much it. Now, uh, what else we have? Logo, so you can change the logo uh, from your website. So as you can so see here, it was just a text. But if you click here, you can click set a logo. And then if you had a logo, you could choose something and then it would be added here as a logo, right? I just added an image, but if you have a logo file, that's how it would happen. You can resize and make it lots of different things with it. You can also change the position. So it's super straightforward. I'm just gonna remove this because, well, let's agree, it doesn't look great only with a regular image. But if you have a logo, I bet it's gonna look awesome. All right, so this is pretty much it. After you've done all the changes you want, you just hit save. And then if you hit publish on the trial, it will tell you here that you need to upgrade to publish. And that's what I told you. If you head on to one.com, you can find all the plans available for you. And then you can choose the best one that suits you. And then you can publish your website. That's super easy. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, you can leave down a message in the comment section down below and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. Thank you very much. And I see you guys in the next one.